Hi, all. Good afternoon. It's Saturday. Well, not noon. It's probably like 3 o'clock, 4 o'clock. I'm not even sure the time because I've been down here all day listening to music and trying to get all my resin done. <clears throat> and I did put glue all in my paint because I had no medium. I usually use Gat, the Gat 800, but I had none, so I used uh, glue all. And that's a good medium also that really helps you spread out your color get it exactly the way you want it now maybe i should do just no i don't want to do a flip cup although you have to do a flip cup to do a flip cup drag a drag pull you got a trick and this is to be honest with you i put no cell uh you know liquids in here at all so if i get cells that's a miracle that would be nice and this is another house paint. It's a gray color, very pretty gray. So I'm gonna do the flip cup. Let's see, should I put it on a board and then flip it on? Yeah, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna flip it on a board first to then flip it on the canvas. I guess I don't have to put any colors around. I was gonna push some, some white around it but it already has uh, a lot of white around it, so it makes no sense to do that. I got plenty of white. If I would have put more white, this would have been too white. So it's a good thing I didn't do that, but I love this color, it's a beautiful, gorgeous color. Look at that, isn't that gorgeous? Love it! Yeah, 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 that's a beautiful color beautiful colors together right green brown and gray white and uh where's my torch get it to torch a little bit before i put it up yes. there we go i've got monstrous small cells but they're monstrous a lot of them <laughs> And I got no cells right here. It's fine the way it is. I like it. I love how beautiful it looks. So, uh, I don't think I need to move it much. I'm just going to leave it. Oh, and I did tape the back. For those who were saying, I heard somebody saying that um, what you do to the back when you do acrylic pores, I tape my backs with the same blue tape that I tape on my resin pour because I don't like my bats to be all painted unless I decide to paint it or whoever wants it, wants it painted. I told you, which one else? The turquoise, I said I made it with just mixing black and royal blue. I do that at times because I love the way those two colors look together. And I'm just gonna enter a little bit more brown in here because there's no brown in here. And the brown kind of got lost in the in the mush of everything so i want the brown in there uh any more gray yeah no leave it without the gray it's fine i don't have that much gray left anyway so this piece right here let's see if i could get to drag it out a little bit so i could get some cells in it that would be nice especially that's the area where i spill some paint then yeah just rub it down like that with your stick and you can get some nice cells in that area so i gotta wash this and i gotta wash this so put that over there and that's it for this one guys it looks so beautiful i gotta give you a close-up let me give it another torch one more I mean, I act like this is a resin. The resins, we usually give it two torches, you know? <laughs> and I did some boo-boo here. Of course, I did a boo-boo here. Yeah, when I pass by with the gray paint, I kind of hit it, that area. Oh, it looks better now. All right, so let me give you a close-up. Mm -hmm. For that paint to get dry so I could do uh resin pour on this round one that round one may be on wednesday look how beautiful that is look at those cells gorgeous 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 well it pays to buy good paint right you get the best paint when you 
my good paint. Look at the edges. I love those edges, the way they turned out. Look at that. Look at the brown. <laughs> I had to add more brown in there because it just looked too bright everywhere. And I love the changes of all these colors coming together. Yeah. It's a bunch of little cells there. They're not so big, which is fine. Quite okay with me. I like them. These are beautiful right here. You know, you don't have to get cells in every corner of your painting. I like getting cells every once in a while. I don't like them all over the place. So that is it, guys. Have a wonderful, wonderful weekend. Love you.